Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Makeup Basket Time. Every Friday I post a video going through my collection, picking out items from every category, and this is just the makeup that I use all week long. I get ready for work really quickly because I'm not digging through stuff looking for eyeliners or what kind of color, and if I want to stray and I'm in the mood to use something else, I'll grab it. It's not a big deal. This is more so a guide and it helps me rotate through my makeup more effectively. All of that good stuff. Let's get started. Hmm. I haven't used this in forever. This is my Garnier BB Queen. This is the medium deep uh, for combination to oily skin. I think I like that one better, the combination to oily skin. So I'm gonna grab that one. Um, what else should I grab, guys? And I think I'll grab this L'Oreal Magic Nude Liquid Powder. It's the Bare Skin Perfector. It has SPF 18. I have it in Sand Beige. And this is actually really like watery kind of consistency. I'm sure you guys have heard about it. It came out like a year or two ago, but um, I really do like that. And I will use my Boo Boo Cover Up Concealer. We got this in an Ipsy bag, and I usually don't need to use anything else if I'm using this, so that's it. Um, I know I used this last week, but I'm gonna use my L'Oreal True Match Mineral Powder again. I have it in Light Ivory, and it's just really transparent, so the color doesn't really matter much. And I haven't used this guy in a while. This is my Urban Decay Naked Flushed, and I really like it, so I will use it let me not blind you guys for the powder the highlight and the blush i actually really love traveling with this because i'll use this as a bronzer highlight and blush but also um i will use all three colors sorry on my eyes which is just amazing this is such a dual purpose multi quadruple purpose kind of um little palette so really really great and this is just the first one that came out i didn't splurge on the other ones okay 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 what else for blush so let me look at that blush again so i don't do okay so that's like a nice deeper color i think i'll also grab from tarte this is peaceful so this is more of like a peachy colored blush and i just have some shimmer in there it definitely yeah definitely has some shimmer but it's just like a light peachy color and if you blend it out it just has like it turns into more of a sheen you guys can't see that at all sorry but i'm gonna grab that it's really pretty and I think I will grab Hound's Tooth from the Balm. Absolutely love that. And just to throw in something, I think I'll grab this fine one, one from Benefit. And this is another kind of trio with the highlight um, and then two blush colors that mix in and it's a cream blush stick. I really do like this. So I'm gonna grab those for blushes. And let's move up here to palette. You know what? I haven't used my Too Faced palette. Someone was using this. Maybe Melanie from Mr. Kong's Mom. And I was like, wow, I haven't used mine in forever. So I'm going to grab my Chocolate Bar palette. Look how stunning. This also has some really nice like highlight colors that you can put on your cheeks if you want. But this has really everything I'll need. So I think I'm just going to grab this for my eyes and that's it. I love that palette, guys. I really do. I just never get to use it. Okay, and then for the rest of my eyes, I think I'll grab this also from an Ipsy bag. This is just from that Martini brand that Ipsy carries a lot, and it's in violet, and it's a shadow tint, and it just has like a, um, you know, doe foot applicator like that, and you just kind of stick that on your lid as a base. I think I'll grab that, and I do like it. And... Okay, let's just grab stuff, because we all know how I am. Where's my trusty uh, Kat Von D? Purple, I'm always gonna want. Um, this is Homey from Kat Von D, the liner. Ugh, and it has like a smudge end here. <sighs> Adore this. It came in a kit, so I don't know. I just can't spend that much money on an eyeliner singly, like high end, but it's a really great liner and I love it. This is the Revlon Photo Ready Kajal Intense Eyeliner. It's an emerald empire. It has a nice emerald side and then like a nude side. And this is the L'Oreal Voluminous Smoldering Eyes um, kind of coal liner. It's just like a big jumbo eye pencil and I love this. And you know what? Let's get crazy. Should I grab Utopia? I'm not going to use Utopia. I have nowhere to go. But I'm looking at some of these and they're just so pretty. That Utopia that I first pulled out is from Makeup Geek. Look how stunning that is. And this eye dust is from Jessie's Girl and Pixie Dust. I think I'm going to grab Afterglow from Makeup Geek. Um, I got this because Jaclyn Hill. I actually got both of them because of Jaclyn Hill. But this is just stunning. These are like older so they don't have sifters. But it's just beautiful. And I think with the Too Faced palette it'll look stunning. And I think I will grab 
my CK1 mascara. And I'm only going to use this one um, because it does have like a dual wand. Look how cute, guys. Hi, I hope I watch it Mickey. Just chilling. Um, and then you twist it here and the wand gets like small and chubby. Can you see? See? And I really like that. So do you like my sound effects? <laughs> so I think I'm going to do that. And I guess that's up there. And then lips. Let's grab a few different colors. Um, I will grab this Tarte and Watermelon. This Tarte lipstick, really vibrant, right guys? Um, but I tend to sheer it out a bit. And I think I'll grab my Revlon Colorburst Matte Balm in, is this Sultry? Oh guys, every time I wear this, I get compliments. I mean, I wear it, look, it's not even pointed. It's beautiful, I absolutely love it. Um, I think I'll grab my Serenity and Scott. This is in Bunny. I got this when I was in IMATS and it's just gorgeous. Oh, I love it. Let me zoom in a little bit because you guys tend to like this drawer. That way you guys can like see some of the products I have and if you want me to talk about them. Hmm. I have so many I don't really get to like dig into the bottom. I think I'm gonna grab these. My Maybelline Color Whisper and Strike a Rose. I don't like the Revlon Lip Butters. I do like the Maybelline Color Whispers more. So this is Strike a Rose. And then this is a newer Revlon Gloss in HD Pink Diamond. Really pretty. Oh, it's stunning. I'm gonna grab those. Look at some of these colors, guys. Look at those. I wanna put them all on. Okay, I have to. I saw it, I know I have to. This is L'Oreal. This is in number 173, Velvety Fuchsia. This is the L'Oreal Color Riche. It's like a bomb. I love it. It's so vibrant. So beautiful. Okay, enough with the pink. There's never enough with the pink. Let's try and get a little bit more neutral. Um, let's get in here. Oh, I haven't used this. This is Chelsea Girls. It's a NARS... Um, little one of those pots so I think I'll grab that Ooh, and then nude lust from Maybelline tried and true I love this I use this a lot I have used that boy a lot okay I think that's it I have a lot of stuff in here and then for my nails I'm just shaking it up you can see the light going this is a Sally Hansen miracle gel color this is in pretty piggy and it is just a really pretty pink color it has a tad binge of a tad tinge of coral in there but it's just so pretty i know these are supposed to last super long and i do have the top coat but i don't find that it lasts two weeks um close to a week maybe which is still pretty good but i'm going to use it again because i haven't used it in a really long time so i'm going to use that on my nails so that is it guys that's my makeup basket i hope you enjoy stay beautiful stay blessed comment down below i hope you had a great week and i hope you're going to have a great weekend and upcoming week bye guys